For a high school athlete, there is nothing more valuable than her or his letter jacket. So a Sandia High School basketball star was really bummed when a thief stole his from his car. But he got it back when a high school basketball fan spotted someone wearing it miles away downtown, someone who clearly did not belong in that letter jacket. News 13's Tina Jensen has the story. When Tim Brennan isn't in class, he's on the court. That's him, number 24. The six foot five forwards letterman jacket represented a rite of passage earned with a lot of hard work at Sandia High School. A few months ago in a restaurant parking lot, it was stolen. A skunk got into our garage that day and I had my windows cracked all day to try to get the smell out. And when we came out, the passenger side one was all the way down and my jacket was gone. It was a big deal to me. I, and I had just gotten all my patches on from the previous year. It turns out having his name emblazoned on the back wasn't the theft insurance he thought it was. After a few months and no sign of it, he gave up hope. It might still be gone if it weren't for a city employee at the downtown transit center who noticed a man wearing the letter jacket. Anthony Chavez, a security officer, is a, high, is a fan of high school basketball uh, in New Mexico, and knows that Tim Brennan is 6'5". And so he approached this guy and said, uh, where'd you get this jacket? The guy avoided him. Chavez didn't give up, and when he told the man he'd have to talk to police, the man handed over the jacket and took off. Then Chavez called the high school. I was really excited. I, I didn't really believe it at first, to be honest. The family's thankful for the man who went out of his way, and Tim's mother says the security officer's name is no coincidence. She'd spent months praying to St. Anthony, the patron saint of lost articles. I said that a million times, and after three months I thought, oh well, St. Anthony's busy. We will not get that check back. But then, who would have known St. Anthony's last name is Chavez? It's Anthony Chavez who found the jacket and returned it to us. Tina Jensen, KRQE News 13. St. Anthony Chavez has been recognized for his good work before. He was the city's employee of the week a few years ago after he identified a wanted fugitive at the Alvarado Transit Center.